from there to here. I'm Linda Bozowski. I live at 388A Orrington Lane in the Rossmore community here in Monroe. I just made a couple of notes over the last couple of days because I was on the BOE website looking for the superintendent search updates on the website. And the most recent ones that I saw were dated in May. I don't understand that because my understanding was that the Office of OFAA, I think is the acronym, I'm not certain, excuse me, was that the corrective action plan was supposed to be published. And I have not seen it published. Um, so I'd be interested in hearing what it is and seeing it published and as well as other items related to the search um, being publicly noticed on the district's website. Making Instagram pages and other such social media pages <clears throat> doesn't work for everyone. I don't do Instagram, whatever. Second comment is related, I, I agree with Liz that uh, AD is inappropriate at this time for the reasons that she stated and for the reasons that I stated to each of you in a letter that I sent to each of you this morning around 10 after 10 saying that I opposed, uh, that once again I was directing the letter to Mr. Anderson at the county superintendent's office urging that, that tonight's decision, which at that, when I got the agenda yesterday was not part of the agenda but was added this morning, um, that this decision be deferred until such time as the, um, the verdict of the courts as defined in the Lillian Isaacs versus BOE uh, was, was past the stay <coughs> period and, and the determination could be made regarding eth ethics decisions and other such issues. Uh, my other question though is, uh, and those were comments, I realize those were not questions. My other quest, my question is, and I do not know Ms. Allen, I've never met her before, I didn't know she was Ms. Allen until she came in tonight. Um, we are appointing her to some unnamed position here at a salary that ends up being $235,648. Um, what is the position or title? Why are we appointing her to a 24-month position as what? And most particularly, why is this salary, including an extra $7,500 a month, for what? And does this position that she is going to be taking on, if you vote in favor, include business administrator and board secretary? What is it? Thank you. Thank you. So the position is not an untitled position. It is acting um, business administrator. It is a one-year contract that has been uh, previously approved by the county superintendent. Um, the extra $7,500 was brought to the personnel committee for discussion, and that is because Ms. Allen has been working both her assistant business administrator position as well as her acting business administrator position, and the, the um, workload has increased significantly okay. and it got brought to the personnel committee who accepted it and brought it forth tonight for a vote of the board um, to approve that to compensate her for the work that she has been doing. It is a one year contract, not a, another 24 month contract. All right, may I clarify one point then? Sure. To what you're saying, Mrs. Kirby? So she will not be functioning as the board secretary? No, In that is correct. Mrs. Tagliaferra is the acting board secretary. OK. 